I wake up in the morning. Um, I usually crawl out of bed because I'm usually really sleepy. Um, oftentimes I have court in the morning. So I will have to get into my uniform and go before a judge and testify to a traffic ticket I wrote or testify to a case that I've been on. Um, I work second shift, which means I work two o'clock to midnight. So I usually go home and eat lunch or uh, have my own personal time. At the start of my shift, um, I'm very methodical. So when I put on my uniform, I make sure that my tie is perfect, my tie bar is perfect. I make sure that my boots are completely shined, my, my gun is fully loaded. Um, I go and inspect my entire patrol vehicle. Um, I make sure that there's no defects in it, all the lights are working, the siren's working. The start of my shift is signified by me checking in to central dispatch and I say, hey dispatch, I'm here, I'm ready, send me somewhere. Um, more often than not, at the start of my shift, they'll send me right away to an emergency call. Currently, I patrol Wayne County, um, and Wayne County has um, a really elaborate array of freeway systems. So uh, people call 911 all the time. Their car is disabled in the middle of the highway, um, or there may be shots fired in the area. Um, sometimes I respond to domestic uh, violence cases on the side of the road. Um, quite often, we'll respond to car crashes where there's people injured, where they'll have to be taken to the hospital. Um, so part of my job is I respond to each of these situations with a fresh mind. Um, and after about six or seven of these in a row, it, that's, that's quite the challenge. Um, but part of my job is to be an impartial investigator. So I'm in part, whoever is on scene, uh, no matter what they look like, what their background is, I respond and I listen to both stories. Uh, how fast were you going? Um, and I, and I investigate like a detective, uh, my, my crime scene or my scene that occurred just there. Um, I always give first aid for people who need first aid. So whether or not um, they have a small cut on their arm, I might just give a Band-Aid, or that could be as big as doing CPR on the side of the road, uh, making sure that they get to the ambulance, they get to the hospital. Throughout my day, um, I might also get some investigative cases where um, a full-blown investigation might have to occur. So this could include things like child abuse, adult abuse, it could include drug usage. When I'm not being tied in with these investigations, I'm just out on patrol. I drive around um, looking for um, unsafe drivers to protect the public. So oftentimes um, we'll run into people who are drinking and driving or texting and driving, which we should never do because um, it looks like drinking and driving and it is quite dangerous or people who are falling asleep at the wheel. Um, and yeah, part of my job is just to patrol the roads and make sure that people get home safely where they can kiss their kids at night, right? Um, and, and hug their families and do their homework and do what they need to do to uh, get home safe. Um, and then at the end of my shift, uh, hopefully if I've had time to eat, I'll, I'll eat my lunch by then. Um, I unfortunately or fortunately, depending on how you see it, have a lot of report writing in my job. That's one of the big secrets of law enforcement is that we have a lot of paperwork that we have to do. So every incident that I, I go on, I have to fill some sort of paperwork for it. Um, my shift ends at midnight, but oftentimes I'm usually staying over to wrap up paperwork or to wrap up a scene um, to make sure that I touch base with my sergeant and ask any questions that I have. Um, at the very end of the day, probably the most um, best part of my day is um, just hanging up my hat and um, we all wear bulletproof bulletproof vests. So taking off the vest is just this like huge relief because it's kind of constricting. So it actually feels really great to take it off. It's one of those things where um, hanging up the vest, hanging up the uniform, hanging up the badge, it's 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 a good time to reflect um, right before that, right before I get to go home, all the people that I've gotten to help the whole day. So yeah, that I would consider that my my whole day, my whole shift.